Hey, what's going on everybody? Welcome to Quick Brick Games, where we cover all the latest LEGO game information and make guides and everything like that. So today we have a video about, once again, LEGO Star Wars The Skywalker Saga, which of course is the big LEGO game coming out in 2020, seems to be the only LEGO game coming out in 2020. TT Games is putting all their resources into this game to make it the biggest LEGO game ever created, so it's got a lot of hype around it. Uh, so as you guys know, or most of you guys know, there hasn't been any new information about this game in about five to six months now. Uh, June, back in E3, mid-June, was the last time uh, we, well that was, that was when we got the confirmation that this game even exists at all, which was pretty cool. Uh, but other than that, they haven't really talked about it at all since then. Uh, there was a bunch of interviews that came out around the time of E3 uh, and stuff like that, uh, where they revealed different information, we got different facts, we had a video about uh, an interview interview that came out around E3, which you can check that out in the description, but other than that, it's been pretty silent, and, you know, it would have been nice, you know, if uh, TT Games could give us, like, screenshots, like, once a week or once every two weeks or something, just a new screenshot of the game, I feel like that would be pretty easy for them to do, because they released about six or seven of them around E3, and there's just been nothing, so they've been pretty silent about it, and of course, I uh, made a video predicting that the game could show up at XO19, it did not, unfortunately, so, uh, Still no new information there. I thought it made sense because at E3 the game was revealed at Microsoft's press conference so I thought maybe Microsoft and TT Games or I guess it's Warner Brothers that's above TT. I don't, I don't know how all that works but I thought it seemed like Microsoft and the LEGO games had something going on there with their reveal at uh, E3 at the Microsoft conference so I thought maybe it would show up at XO19 but that didn't happen either which was kind of disappointing. I thought there was actually a decent chance of seeing something there, but it, was, it wasn't was even present at all, not even mentioned. No one else seemed to be talking about it, so it seemed, it seemed like I was the only one, so that was unfortunate. Uh, so it seems TT Games does not want us to know anything about the game yet, but we have a new event coming up here this Thursday at 8.30 p.m. Eastern Time, and that is the Game Awards 2019. Uh, this is a show uh, hosted by a guy named Jeff Keighley, and... Uh, this show, you know, it announces the game of the year and stuff like that, which is based on people voting and all that sort of thing. I guess people vote, and then uh, some, like, gaming journalists and, you know, people in the game industry then decide based on those votes, you know, what the games of the year games of the year are based on each category or something. I don't really know how it all works, but that's not what we're interested in. Uh, the big uh, point about this event is that there are different game reveals and game announcements at this event as well, other, you know, kind of in between the different awards that the games are getting. So I'm thinking that LEGO Star Wars The Skywalker Saga could show up at the Game Awards 2019. They said there's going to be a bunch of reveals and whatnot and then trailers. So I'm thinking we maybe could get a trailer for LEGO Star Wars The Skywalker Saga uh, because uh, there is some evidence to back this up. Because I was doing some research, and back at the Game Awards 2015, so four years ago now, which is kind of crazy, uh, LEGO Marvel's Avengers, that game, which ended up coming out in 2016, I believe, that game actually was uh, announced at the Game Awards, or had a trailer at least. So it's not unprecedented for a LEGO game to show up at the Game Awards event, which I think is kind of interesting. So there is a chance of the game showing up there. Um, of course, uh, LEGO Marvel's Avengers was a decently... Uh, big LEGO game that was based around the movies at the time, you know, Avengers, Age of Ultron, and all that. So we could see a trailer at the Game Awards 2019, that's kind of my prediction. Uh, I, don't, I don't know if I even want to call it a prediction, uh, it's kind of my, uh, you know, I think there's a possibility of it showing up. I'm not saying uh, it will or that it's likely, but I'm saying that there's a possibility. Um, and you know, I wouldn't expect like a big long gameplay session or reveal of the game, I would just expect like a just a short maybe two minute trailer or something like that because this isn't the kind of event you know where you'd have a big gameplay uh, reveal or a 10 minute long gameplay segment or something like that it would probably just be a trailer but the trailer of course could show gameplay and actual footage of the game because the trailer that we have at e3 is just uh which is probably playing over this right now is uh you know just cgi and stuff it doesn't actually show what the game is going to look like but uh overall i'd say this is our last chance of seeing the game this year at 2019 um, I don't see them, uh, you know, randomly coming out with a trailer, you know, after Christmas time or anything like that. I guess it's possible, but I'm, I'm not seeing it. They'll probably wait until maybe January or February of 2020 uh, to show anything more. And it's possible they could be waiting until uh, after Episode 9, The Rise of Skywalker, comes out. Because uh, uh, the game might heavily be based around Episode 9, we don't know. Uh, and what I mean by heavily based is, I guess I mean it's heavily marketed around episode 9, because if you remember back in 2005, for some of you older guys, 
um, the original LEGO Star Wars the video game, which was the game that kind of started it all uh, with these LEGO games, uh, that game uh, was kind of marketed around Episode 3, Revenge of the Sith, you know, even the cover of the game, you know, had the Mustafar lava as like the main focus, you know, and it was kind of, it released alongside or at least uh, close uh, to the release of Episode 3 at the time, so it was kind of marketed around that game. They could be trying to do the same thing uh, with uh, the Skywalker Saga, where they could kind of be maybe promoting it with Episode 9. Maybe they'll promote it with the, uh, you know, Blu-ray release of Episode 9 when that comes out, you know, and probably like March or April. I don't, I don't see the game coming out that soon. Uh, as I've said in previous videos, I see the game coming out in June 2020. I don't see it coming out, uh, you know, in uh, uh, sooner than that. At least I'm basing that off of the Force Awakens release date. If you remember Lego Star Wars The Force Awakens back in 2016, it released around June uh, when Episode 7 came out in, like, you know, December. So I'm thinking this, they could do a follow a similar schedule this time and come out with uh, episode, uh, or the Skywalker Saga in uh, June of 2020, but we'll have to see, you know, maybe they'll wait all the way till November of next year, maybe we could be a year off from this game, and uh, they'd wait till the new consoles come out so the game can launch, you know, on the old consoles and the new consoles, it'd be like a cross-generational game. Uh, so we'll have to see, we'll have to see. Uh, if it's not the awards show again, I think it's gonna be in probably January or February of 2020 when we actually get a trailer or something, but we'll just have to wait and see. Uh, but anyway, that's going to be it for this video. We could see LEGO Star Wars The Skywalker Saga at the Game Awards 2019. We'll just have to wait and see if there's anything there. I will have a video about it. You can uh, bet that and we will be analyzing anything that they show if they do. If not, you know, I'm not saying it's going to happen. You know, don't blame me if it doesn't show up. But I'm just saying that there's a possibility just to, you know, kind of put this event on your radar. So again, the Game Awards are on Thursday night. Uh, I believe it's December 12th, uh, it's going to be at 8.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, so you can translate that, uh, you know, to your own time zone. And yeah, that's going to be it. Uh, be sure to subscribe to be notified right when the latest LEGO information comes out, not only the Skywalker Saga, but anything LEGO, you know, after the Skywalker Saga, there's going to be other stuff coming out, and we'll have content about that as well. But be sure to like the video if you enjoyed it. Do you agree with my prediction? Do you think it's going to come, or do you think we're going to get information at uh, the Game Awards 2019, or do you think they're just going to keep waiting until sometime after the Rise of Skywalker releases? Let me know, but that's going to be it. I'll see you guys later.